we got power guys guys uh you know it was, it was really good obviously to come out and you know I thought Hess was throwing the ball all right to get a couple of runs off him just singular home runs um you know pretty big ball I mean that ball Gary hit that's 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 a long way right there and um so it was good to to get some points on the board in that way and then and then with two outs to be able to add a run with the Talkman base hit gave us you know just a little bit of breathing room but um you know a good way to start the day Claber mentioned that with two days off guys were ready to get back out there and produce did you sense at all that guys were itching to to get on the field and finally play <clears throat> no doubt um and you know it's not very often that we play where it's so sparse out there. So it felt a little odd at first to me. And one of the things you, you kind of concern yourself with is making sure we're we're locked in and ready to go. And, and the guys came out. I thought the energy was good. I thought the focus was really good. And uh, and they performed. And and uh, and then you know Jay Jay got us through the middle inning there. And then the the bullpen did the rest. But I thought a good job by our guys on kind of a weird you know three o'clock start with sparse crowd you know it's you know after having a couple days off um really like the way the guys came out half toss just 64 pitches knowing you have a full another game tonight was there temptation to leave him in there and see oh yeah how far he could go oh yeah um absolutely but felt like felt like to that point um we were kind of set up perfectly to 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 piece it together um the way we, the way that we did and just felt like that that part of the lineup really wanted Otto in in that spot in a, in a tight game and uh you know felt like especially you know with the off day behind the couple of days we just had felt like we were arrested and ready to go and but there was absolutely it was it was a tough call for me because I, I actually felt like Jay started to throw the ball even a little bit better as the game wore on Susan do, do you have any of those people for the second game? Yeah, we'll probably have at least a couple of them. Uh, I mean, that's something now over the next hour. We'll see how guys react. But, um, you know, the way we kind of pieced it together with most of them not throwing a lot of pitches should put us in position um, to have those guys. George, to the right. Aaron, is Morales here? Morales is here. And will he be activated? He, he will be. He's in the lineup. Do you have a move? Uh, we optioned uh, Harvey. Kenny, to the left. Aaron, um, you talked with Jay for a moment there uh, when you went out. Uh, I mean, did he know that he was going out there just for Smith? Or how did that no, unfold? No, he, you know, I think wanted to stay in and, you know, rightfully so, you know, and I felt, feel like he started um, even getting into a little more of a groove there, um, you know, and I think he wanted to stay. Nolan, obviously, we have two games, but um, I just felt like that was the spot in the order we wanted to, not let it get away and kind of stop the game right there and we were lined up to to not overuse our guys in that situation so um you know he wanted the ball obviously so uh which i would expect nothing less is your general rule with him that you rather have him avoid the, the bulk of the third time through the lineup no not necessarily i mean it just you know uh mancini and ha uh, nunez have been you know, a little tough on him this year. Not that he's not capable of going and getting it done against them, but uh, no, I mean, it, look, every game's a little bit different depending on usage and days off and where you are. So there's going to be times where, you know, he's going to go through that and he's going to have to push through and, and get us deep into the game. You know, today was a day where we felt like at that spot in a tight game, we were lined up the right way. Brendan, all the way to the right. Just back to the crowd again a little bit. Uh, how much can that affect a player? How much can that affect just everything in general, seeing such a sparse crowd, things right. being so quiet? How how weird is that? It was, it was different, you know, because, you know, with the Yankees, obviously we're so used to a full house or – um, and even when we go on the road, you know, you're, you're used to that. So when all of a sudden you're in an environment where, you know, people are filing in – uh, when you first walk out there, it, it you know, whether it affects you or not, I mean, we, we're, maybe we all, uh, I, you know, it bugs me that we always go back and say that was the reason why, which necessarily is, which isn't necessarily the case. That said, you know, when I walked out there today, I was like, well, it's a little different. You know, let's make sure our energy's good. And to the guy's credit, it was great.